It's your boy Noel Lynch here, and you're here for a weekly roundup of round 10 footy. Let's do this, hey? Let's get stuck into it. Round 10. What the fuck happened with the port game, hey? What happened with the port game? What happened? Two points. But you know why it was two points? Because the umpires decided to get fucking involved. They think because you give them a whistle and a fucking yellow top that they all of a sudden become fucking president of the world. Oh, fuck me. Like what? Ball comes down. Robbie Gray gets held like fucking a black chick. He's fucking, oh shit, no, we will not call that whistle, no. No, play on. You know what? Selwood gets poked in the face. Oh, you know, that's uh, that's just not on. That's not acceptable, Paul LA. You should know better. You're not even allowed to look at Selwood or Daniel Field because you know what? It'll be a free kick. Charlie Dixon, mate. Oh my God. You got up fucking slower than a fucking truck gets to top speed, mate. You fucking, I don't know, you marked, you marked it. You sat there for about an hour, decided to get up. Your walk was like a kilometre. And then all of a sudden it's play on. You fucking, you gave it to some terrorist dude that couldn't even kick fucking 20 metres if he tried. Fuck me. Daniel Field, he came past, he scored. That's what a Brownlee medalist does. He just easily did it. But the umpires, I'm not even going to bother analysing the game. The umpires fucking ruined it. So my one vote goes to, um... Old mate, good old Jared Pollock, who's Port's best player. He tried his heart out, unlucky, mate. Two votes, Joe Selwood. He's a cockhead, he's a sook, but he played well. And Daniel Field, I fucking want to kill this cunt, but, you know, he's a good player. Um, second game, Hawthorne beat the Suns by six points. No one gave a shit, because, you know, at the start of the year, everyone was calling him Owen. Owen 1, Owen 2, Owen 3, Owen 4, Owen 5. You know, rough head, what a comeback. 12 months out of the game from cancer, comes back, kicks a goal. I'll take it to you, mate. Well done. You're still a runger, though. Um, Franklin, he does it. He's Sydney's best player. He's like the LeBron James for AFL. Everyone hates him, but he'll always score a goal. he always kick more. He's averaging like four. He, he never misses. He's a good player. You might hate him. I love him. Good player. He earns millions. You earn nothing. Suck shit, you're a gay count. Um, I reckon uh, Sydney still had 20 interchange people to make. 20, they were spent with like five minutes ago. They still had 20 interchanges to make. Should have made them. Learn how to coach. One vote to Franklin, two votes to Tom Mitchell, and three votes to Liam Shields. No, it was shit though. The doggies. Fucking beat St. Kilda by 40 points. I don't know what happened here. I honestly do not. St. Kilda won all the cl more clearances. More marks, more tackles, more shots. But they couldn't score. They're like, shit. I'm telling you right now, if Bulldogs need a star Ruckman, okay? Honestly, if they had a star Ruckman, I'd tell you right now, oh, mate. They'd go fucking 100 premierships. They've got a great team, but they don't know who the fuck they're rucking them. They're going to end up bringing some fucking 20-year-old 20, 20 from fucking some A-grade team in because they've got no Ruckman. Um, one vote to Franklin, two votes to Tom Mitchell. Oh, that's the wrong game. <laughs> One vote to the Bonton Pelly, two votes to Stringer, three votes to Jack Neils. Even though they lost, he played a great game and he fucking shut all over you. The Demons beat the Suns by 35. The Suns are shit. The Demons, three years' time, they're the real deal. Clayton Oliver, he's a gun. He's above everyone. Right, I don't care. He's young, he's fit, he's fast. He's hot. But he's kind of rang us so no one likes him. But that's okay. Imagine if Gorm was still playing. He's a fucking terrorist. Look at him. Beard down to here. Like that. And he's like fucking massive. Like, holy shit. Fuck me, Dad. He's a great player. Melbourne, they just play hard, fast football. Ugh, just just great to watch. That's what you come to see. Um, one vote to Nathan Jones. He played really well. Two votes to Clayton Oliver. And three votes to... Old mate Jeffy Garlick. He, it's Indigenous round. Someone needed to step up. And Jeffy Garlick decided to kick a bag. He did kick four points. But that's because he's a shit cunt and he doesn't train. He's too busy drinking. Um, fuck me. The Crows. 100 points to Frio. Fuck me, Frio. Shit. Um, they just won everything. He was wet. He was disgusting. It's like I've just pulled down my pants and pissed all over Adelaide Oval. Fucking hell. Um, everyone fucked. Every player from Crows fucked up Fremantle. 
Freeman or need help badly and as quick as possible. They're doing nothing free agency. They're losing that five. They're only good, decent player. What are you going to do, mate? Mind you, they got to, they need something. Hopefully they can get the number one draft pick. Because, yeah, they've won a few games, but they're just not a quality team anymore. They've lost it. I mean, five for them in there. Fucking Santa Lee is getting injured like more than fucking times. Um, one vote to Jack Lever. Great back, man. 15 intercept, intercept marks. Sloan. Course, gun, and three votes. Matt Crouch, he's just, he was just, he was a great young player. Collingwood beat Brisbane. Brisbane are officially shit, and that's all there is to say, pretty much. Collingwood's big three stood up again. Taylor Allen, Scott Pranning, and Adam Trelaw. Them guys are like, you You put them, you have sex with all three of them, you will not be able to stand. They are like rapists out on the field. They fucking kill them. Um, If Zorko, Dane Zorko plays Brisbane, if he played for a decent team, Give him the brown load. He's a gun every week. Winning week in and out. He's just too good. He steps up, but he has a shit team, so it doesn't matter. Collingwood need a key forward. I can't stress this enough. They can't kick straight. If they had a key forward, they would win the brown uh, win the premiership. Sorry, they're just too they get it in there so many times, but they can't kick fucking straight. Um one vote to Scott Prendenbury. Two votes. To Adam Trelaw, and this is really two buyers and two buyers. Three votes to Taylor Adams. I love him. North beat Carlton by 17 points, but no one cares. So I'm not going to really analyse this game. Carlton are just shit. Doherty, Chris, Simpson, Gibbs. All guns, but they play for a shit cunt team, so it doesn't matter. I kind of feel sorry for them. North Melbourne chance. Don't you chill out. It's only fucking Carlton. Um, one vote to Doherty. Two votes to... <laughs> Two votes to Gibbs and three votes to Luke Henderson. Um, GWS, first time they've beaten fucking West Coast. You beauty. I feel sorry because West Coast, GWS, had nine of their starting 18 players out and they still won. What a game, the resilience and everything. Um, is it the year? I know everyone's talking about Crows and Geelong, but is it the year now for GWS? They fucking raped last year but just fell I reckon it come down to experience. They have it now. I reckon it's their year. Um, one vote to Andrew Gaff, two to Callum Ward, and three to Toby Green. Um, Richmond beat Essendon by 15. Dusty Martin. That's all there is to say. He is a gun. Um, another strange Essendon did beat him in a lot of stats, but they just couldn't win. They beat him in a lot of things, but couldn't do it. Um, they just didn't perform well. Richmond started the season off really good, but they died off just a tad near the, the, in the last couple of rounds. Can they keep it up? Can they make the eight? Or will they go back to ninth because they're useless cunts? Um, one vote to Zara Rakos, two votes to Brennan Ellis, and three votes to my main man, Dusty Martin. And there's a lot of speculation about him too, but honestly, he could win the brown line. Ladies and gentlemen, that is my fucking round 10 wrap-up of... The the football. I hope you enjoyed it. And to every single fucking little stupid ass fucking Bulldogs fan, you can suck my left fucking nut. Okay? Because it's bullshit. I'm signing out. Please subscribe and like the video. Show your friends. Thank you.